Hello and welcome to this video tutorial. Today I'll show you how to create this photo morph effect inside Microsoft PowerPoint. I'm going to start with a brand new PowerPoint slideshow and for this I'm just going to add a blank slide. I'm going to click the insert tab, go to pictures and then this device and I'm going to pick a picture from the collection I'm using. Now for this particular picture I just want it to scale up so that it fills the entire slide so I'm just going to position it over the slide. I'm going to right click and duplicate this slide and I'm going to take the picture off this slide and I'm going to insert a different one. Now if you use different pictures, you're going to need to use a slightly different effect, which is why I want to go through this with you. So I'm going to insert a different picture. I'm going to crop this. So with the picture selected, I'm going to picture format. I'm going to crop and I'm going to choose crop to shape and I'm going to select a circle. So let's go back to the crop tool here and let's just make that more like a circle. I'm just watching up here because it should be 7.5 by 7.5. That will be a circle and then I can click away from this to stop the cropping happening and then I can scale this down should I wish to do so. I'm just holding the shift key as I do. So this is my second image. So first image, second image, they're very different obviously. So to add the morph effect, I'm going to need to name these two images the exact same thing. So with the first slide selected. I'm clicking on the image. I'm going to the home tab on the ribbon. I'm going to select and then selection pane. And this is called picture four because I've been working in PowerPoint. So what I'm going to do is put two exclamation marks in front of its name and note its name. So it's double exclamation mark and in my case it's picture four but it could be two exclamation marks and horse or car or happy whatever you like it doesn't matter what you name it they just have to be named the same thing so over here on this slide it's currently called picture two well it has to be called picture four and it has to have two exclamation marks in front of the file name or the picture name so to create our morph effect, all we're going to do is select the second slide, the one that we want to turn this picture into and go to transitions and then morph and you'll preview the morph effect. So now let's go back to our first slide and let's just preview our slideshow. When I click to change the slide, we're seeing the second image and you can continue to add more images. So I'm just going to right click here and duplicate this slide. So I'm going to take this image, put it over here I'm going to right click and I'm going to change the picture in this case. So I'm going to go and get a different picture from this collection. Now it's being cropped automatically. I will need to apply the morph effect to it but apart from that you'll notice that it has the same name because I just copied the last picture. So even though I changed the picture in this shape, it still has the same name. That just saves me a little bit of work. Let's go to the slideshow. Let's preview this going into one circle, second image, and now moving across to the third image. So this is a way that you can produce really interesting effects on a PowerPoint slide, morphing from one photo into another very, very easily inside PowerPoint. If you like carefully researched content like this, clearly presented in a step-by-step -step format so that you can get great results every time, then you'll love my other YouTube videos. So give this video a thumbs up and click to subscribe to the channel. And on the screen now, you'll see a video that I've handpicked for you to watch next.